हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू ई से अकेडमी इन दिस लेक्चर लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड ए प्रॉब्लम ऑन इनवर्स डीटीएफटी हियर वी नीड टू फाइंड द इनवर्स डीटीएफटी ऑफ द फॉलोइंग सिग्नल वेयर एक्स ऑफ ओमेगा इज गिवन एज 3 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by minus 1 by 16 exponential to the power of minus j 2 omega plus 1. Now first let us consider the denominator part which is minus 1 by 16 exponential to the power of minus j 2 omega plus 1. So this denominator part we can write this as minus 1 by 16 into exponential to the power of minus j omega. Whole square plus one. We can so write this as one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four into one plus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four. So if we multiply these two terms, we'll get this equation. Therefore, we can write x of omega is equal to Three minus one by four exponential to the power of minus j omega whole divided by one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four into one plus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four. So we can write this term as a divided by one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four plus B divided by one plus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four. Therefore, we can write a is equal to one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four, which will be multiplied with three minus one by four exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by. One minus exponential to the power of minus j omega by four into one plus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four. In this equation, we need to take one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega by four equal to zero. So, if we make one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four as zero, we will get exponential to the power of minus j omega as Four. Now let us use this value in this equation. Therefore, we can write a is equal to three minus one by four into, in place of exponential to the power of minus j omega, we can write it as four divided by one plus four by four. So we have substituted value in this term and in this term because these two terms will Cancel out, so we will not substitute for these two terms because in this equation these two terms can be cancelled out. So we can write this as a is equal to one. So we got the value of a as one. Now we can write b is equal to one plus exponential to the power of minus j omega divided by four into 3 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega whole divided by 1 minus exponential to the power of minus j omega by 4 into 1 plus exponential to the power of minus j omega by 4. Again, in this equation, if we put 1 plus exponential to the power of minus j omega by 4 is equal to 0, we will get exponential to the power of minus j omega as minus 4. Let us substitute this value in this equation. Therefore, we'll get b is equal to three minus one by four into minus four, whole divided by one minus minus four by four. So from this, we can say b is equal to two. So we got the values of a as well as b. Let us substitute the value of a and b in this equation. Therefore. We can say x of omega is equal to one divided by one minus exponential to the power of minus j omega by four plus two divided by one plus exponential to the power of minus j omega by four. For this equation, if we take inverse 
dtft will get x of n is equal to 1 by 4 whole to the power of n u of n plus 2 into minus 1 by 4 whole to the power of n u of n. So, this is the inverse dtft for the given sequence. Let us consider the second problem. In this let us take the denominator part which is 1 by 8 into exponential to the power of minus j 2 omega minus 3 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega plus 1. For this denominator part we can write it as 1 by 8 into exponential to the power of minus j omega whole square minus 3 by 4 into exponential to the power of minus j omega plus 1. So, we can write the above equation as 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega into 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega. Therefore, we can write x of omega is equal to 3 minus 5 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega whole divided by 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega into 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega. So, this equation we can write it as a divided by 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega plus b divided by 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega. Now, we can write a is equal to 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega into 3 minus 5 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega whole divided by 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega into 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega. In this equation, if we put 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega is equal to 0. Therefore, we can write exponential to the power of j omega is equal to 4. Now, let us use this value in this equation. Therefore, we can write these two terms will cancel out. We will get a is equal to 3 minus 5 by 4 into 4 whole divided by 1 minus 1 by 2 into 4 that is equal to minus 2 by minus 1. This can be written as a is equal to plus 2. In the same way let us write for b, b is equal to 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega into 3 minus 5 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega whole divided by 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega into 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega. So, in this equation if we take 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega is equal to 0, we can write exponential to the power of minus j omega is equal to 2. If we substitute this value in this equation, we can cancel out these two terms and we can write b is equal to 3 minus 5 by 4 into 2 divided by 1 minus 1 by 4 into 2. From this, we can say b is equal to 1. Now, we got the value of a as well as b. Let us substitute those two values in this equation. Therefore, we will get x of omega is equal to 2 by 1 minus 1 by 4 exponential to the power of minus j omega plus 1 by 1 minus 1 by 2 exponential to the power of minus j omega. Now, if we take inverse dt of t, therefore, we can write x of n is equal to 2 into 1 by 4 whole to the power of n u of n plus 1 by 2 whole to the power of n u of n. So, this is the dt of t for the given sequence. This is about problems on inverse dt of t. Hope you have understood the topic. Thank you.